guys it is a saturday morning and i am on my way to my second panel of the week welcome back to another vlog chaos i'm running behind there's no excuse there's absolutely no excuse but let me show you guys what i'm wearing i'm wearing this top i got from img a few years ago the vintage jacket from one of my previous vlogs i got on ebay the trousers that i also got from ebay and again my absolute faves and this bag i didn't even have time to really do my hair properly or do my makeup properly everything was just a rush so hopefully it goes well and i pass flash photography or, or 4k lenses or all of that crap because this wig i don't even know what's going on this morning um it's not even morning anyway actually it's actually afternoon so let's see how this today goes Yeah. 
they spend rules and you can make your mistakes and look back and laugh and troll yourself and games. <laughs> so yeah, I wouldn't obsess too much over undertone, like just work with what works for you. and Kate <laughs> look at what they've given me for my oily skin oh guys like get into it we're gonna try this and I'll let you guys know all about the tea but they're so great oh guys what a day um I went to pick up some Turkish food from my local because this is the first meal I'm having today <laughs> And when I got home, I just quickly changed, got in the car, <laughs> and went to find food because, bro, your girl has not eaten all day. But I had so much fun on the panel today, and it was so much fun meeting everybody, meeting some of you, some subscribers as well. Like, honestly, warmed my heart because I've been a bit of a, been a bit of a, I've been in a bit of a funk lately. Like, my mood just goes up and down, up and down, up and down, but. That was so cute and so nice. I might step out again this evening just to see Alexa and Precious. But that just depends. If this food gives me a food coma, if I get the itis, I'm not going. My lips are really suffering in this weather. Like, it's hard to stretch them because they're like cracking on the sides and they're sore. Um, they've also gone up, gotten a bit darker as well, which has been happening to me. A lot recently fluctuating so i just need to really find like a really nice good lip mask if you guys have any recommendations please do leave them below because this is just not cute 50 pounds says i'm eating with my eyes oh i cannot wait good morning guys happy sunday look how dark my lips are oh my god and do you know what it's just not really giving anything it's not giving what it's supposed to give like i have naturally very pink lips and this honey is um it looks like i've had botox or fillers or something i know they're gonna heal because this happened to me whilst i was during like the Ibiza Paris stage, I just did it. I just hid it very well. But you know what? I'm so tired of hiding things. I feel like, oh my god, I have to be perfect all the time. So your girl's lips looks like she's been smoking hella ganja. It is what it is. Um, hopefully this clears up by this week. Um, nothing I can really do about it. But it is Sunday morning, and I just wanted to like speak about yesterday because I feel like my mood was just so down a bit. I mean. Actually, no, I was just hungry. I had gone about nine plus hours without eating anything. So I was just really um, hungry and just kind of drained. So, yeah. Um, yesterday was so much fun. I haven't looked at the clips yet. I hope there's... I hope I, hope I vlogged it as much as I possibly could because I got um, Ella... Um, she she's <coughs> she's the person that invited me and reached out to like be on the panel she runs thirsty agency so i'm sorry i just literally cannot take myself seriously i'm looking at myself like i can't even i don't want to stretch my mouth too much because it's gonna all crack and hurt i don't want to do that until i've like gotten in the shower and washed my face and things and then i'll like maybe just put a mask on or something i don't know um but yeah, she runs Thirsty Agency and she's the one that also invited me to Flannels Liverpool. And yeah, so I got her to vlog a few clips. So hopefully you guys can see a bit of what went on. I met some amazing women yesterday. Like, it was just so powerful being in a space of, of um, predominantly black women. It felt safe. There was so much collaboration going on, honesty, and just sharing of knowledge and wisdom, which I found very, very powerful. So for those of you that don't know, it was the Beauty Beat panel yesterday. And I think this is going to become a yearly 
thing and this was like their first ever event and it was so professional it was so good shout out Candice she did an amazing job also kind of like um hosting like she was like yeah kind of hosting like questioning and everything like she's so funny I absolutely adore her but I wanted to show you guys a few things that I've gotten this week my plans for you guys also because I've had a big bag of Ikea stuff um, sitting there for about two months now and kind of I've been wanting to do a giveaway and I discussed this a bit on my live um, a few months ago also that I've been wanting to do a giveaway but I've never done a giveaway and I don't know how it works and I honestly don't want to be involved in any way I want it to be completely 100% fair and I had this company reach out to me called Raffle they're a platform um, known for doing raffles for big brands like Harrods and all sorts so I decided that okay I'm gonna change it from a giveaway to a raffle and each like entry is gonna just be like a pound and what I want the reason why I want to go down that route is just for transparency you guys can you guys can easily be able to log on and see everything that's going on how many entry I don't know if you'll be able to see how many entries but you'll be able to see what's going on when the winner is announced who the winner is and things like that and I want I also had this idea that the proceeds of it like 50% of the proceeds I kind of want to give to families that are struggling in the UK during this time um, I mean we are all struggling every I don't care how much money you make or how much things you own everybody is struggling <laughs> everybody is struggling to some extent some worse than others which is true because we this isn't this isn't our damn <laughs> we are all struggling because this isn't our usual normal none of us are used to the pound basically being one to one with the dollar none of us are used to this awful government that we have in place so the only thing that's kind of holding me back is I don't know how I'm going to find those genuine families that do need that help because me and Stephanie have been on TikTok recently we've been seeing like mothers and women come on TikTok crying their eyes up because um they're, they're having to choose between heating and and um food for their kids even me Steph, me I'm choosing between heating Sha, because heating is so like it is so cold look at me i'm wrapped up i am not even playing it is so cold in this country and everything is so expensive that bro i have to even go and do like but anyway let's not talk about me um yeah so that's where i'm at right now trying to kind of decipher how i navigate that space in finding those families that do need that help um but i also do want to give back to my audience because guys i wouldn't have half of the shit i have or even one percent of the shit i have if it wasn't for you guys following me and just being on this journey with me for so many years which um has been a roller coaster i feel like i'm still trying to navigate this space after so many years and trying to be more open and vulnerable and just you know show the real like these black lips um but let me show you what we have so far and these are some these are products that i genuinely love that i have maybe i have two of them or they're things that i just feel like are in excess because as you guys saw in my last vlog i do have a lot of things in excess and i don't want to hoard things i've always given things out regardless anyway to like family friends or friends or just people that i come across that i know of are in need and i've just never really like spoken about it because like why um oh my god it's heavy <laughs> let me show you so this is kind of like a bag this is just a case that's empty so let me move that aside just full of things we've got YSL Beauty in here Fenty I think I have some hair tools in here as well I can't remember um but yeah there's so much in here that I need to sort out and organize and do this raffle I want this raffle to go live this December no it has to go live before the end of the year because it'll be so nice if we can have this done I can have, give it to the winners and have the money sent to whichever families um, it need be before Christmas so that's what we're going to do I'm 
weekly packing it, packing it and packing it with more and more things because I get lots of delivery and I get um, goodie bags from the events I go to. So I'm constantly like just filling it up with more and more stuff. So if you guys were on my live a few weeks ago, um, there is a lot more stuff in there now. And there was a lot of stuff in there before. There's a lot more stuff in there now. And yeah, that's just kind of what I wanted to share with you. Um, let me show you what I got yesterday, actually. And again, I'm seeing some doubles that I have, things that I already have. So I'm going to have to put that in the giveaway bag slash raffle bag also. And yeah, so this is what I got from... <laughs> Oh my god, almost knocked me out from the Beauty Bee event. I think the girls that attended as well, if you bought a ticket, you should have also like received um, a jam-packed goodie bag. And it's a very, very high-value goodie bag. Let me just say that. I have a Laura Mercier Lux Indulgence um, body triplet set let me open this up I should probably put you guys on a tripod or something but whatever I have a body cream and body wash from Laura Mercier it's kind of like a gift set which is so cute oh my god and there's a fragrance oh guys I'm so sorry I don't have this I'll be keeping this one <laughs> oh! <laughs> okay I can't even laugh properly um Oh, we have some edge control from Argan Oil. We have, oh, vitamin C serum. I love vitamin C serum. Oh, my God. Um, I can't do my skincare routine without having vitamin C as part of my routine. Scalp serum from this hair of mine. I've never heard of this brand, but it looks quite good. But I, I actually use Miel, and I'm trying to stay loyal to them at this moment in time so that will probably also be in the bag i'll probably put polishing powder holistic skincare skin perfecting plant therapy exfoliating brightening and smoothing interesting we have what else do we have some number seven advanced serums so there's a lot of skincare in here for the girls that wanted it to be like a skincare raffle, we've got a mix of skincare and beauty that I'm going to be having in the bag. Oh my god, CeraVe, guys! Oh, this, I swear, by CeraVe moisturizer. Oh my gosh, I don't actually use this one. Um, the one I use is the SA one. It's exactly like this, but it just says like SA and it has like salicylic acid and things like that inside. But CeraVe... Oh my god, I use that. CeraVe is what I use to wash and moisturize and also wash my face. So, yeah. I think I think I should probably put that in the bag. Yeah. <laughs> Cuz I do have CeraVe and I'm happy to buy my own CeraVe to be honest. Oh, intensive hydration mask. I think I'll give this to my mum because she needs a new hair mask which is great timing and cordially makeup removing cleansing oil mm. this is such a good goodie bag we have some pattern i think i already have this um myself in a pr box so this is going to go in the bag and oh my god there's so much nice hair care brands i've never heard of Wak oh, Wakiti, I know this is going to be good. Look at the girl, the afro. Um, water activated advanced conditioner for natural hair with shea and jojoba oils, sulfate free. That looks phenomenal. That looks really, really good, actually. Um, but I think I'll also put that in the bag because I, I just have way too much stuff. Oh, another hair mask from Shea Moisture. And this is the Moisture Replenish and Strength Hair Mask for dry, damaged hair. So I think I'll. I think, I don't think my mum needs both, come on. So one of these will go in the bag as well. Um, mm, hyaluronic treatment lotion from Bumble and Bumble. Okay, we're getting to the very bottom. And there's just like some miscellaneous bits now. 
um, strengthen your skin, bare minerals, that will go in the bag, um, La Roche-Posay, um, pure niacinamide, anti-dark spots, hmm, do I need that though? <laughs> Link it, I'll hopefully have everything set up so it can also be linked once this vlog goes live as well, um, some stuff from Cobba, Cobba Skincare, Ooh. Oh yes, I literally just finished using this lip balm from Cobba, so I will be holding on to that because I need, come on guys, come on, look at my lips, I really do need some help. Nail varnish, this is like, I have this colour, I used to swear by this colour, I don't know if you guys remember like um, my vlogs post just freshly out of our first lockdown and I was kind of like gluing my toenails together because they had cracked, but this was the colour I was using, love, that will be in the box. Um, some MAC lip colour. There's lots of MAC products already in the bag, but I'm going to put more in. Um, Revlon Colour Stay, MAC Crayon, and oh my god, a whitening pen by Dr. Uchenna. I'm not trying to be funny, guys. I think I'll be keeping the whitening pen. <laughs> yeah, so that's everything that was in the Beauty Beat box well beauty beat bag and i will be putting most of this adding most of this to the first ever raffle giveaway by yvonne victoria that will be supporting families in need this christmas yay <laughs> face and base this is the new primer that i got yesterday that i was so thoughtfully gifted and i cannot wait to use this oh my gosh like this is this just warms my heart because it's like my audience know I have oily skin and then oh I just love it I can't wait I'm gonna use this very very soon definitely this week but I actually picked up um I don't know if you saw um, you guys should have probably seen by now there was like this shopping section after the beauty bee event and there were so many brands like NARS um uh Laura Mercier was there and some other brands I just can't remember from the top of my head but I actually bought the blurring powder that's been going semi-viral or viral on TikTok because I actually haven't tried their, this. So this is the Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder Ultra Blur and I got it in my usual shade of Translucent Honey so cannot wait to use that also. Definitely need to film a makeup video this week so I can show you guys all the new products that I'm loving, my new routines, because I didn't, my routine that I did for the House of CB event, oh, I haven't had makeup like that that I've loved in a long time, so I need to film that. And then I actually have a mini primer. It's gonna go in the bag too. So, finishing off this unboxing, I had the, two big bags from elan oh my god they're heavy delivered to me friday evening and i've been meaning to show you guys this like i was so blown away because i knew it was coming but i had forgotten about it and i also didn't know how much effort that they would be putting into this so this is kind of like a christmas gift for me and i just want to show you guys the cake I haven't touched the cake. I've been very, very, very um, disciplined in not trying the cake yet because I want you guys to see it. So, your girl is having some cake today. Look. Merry Christmas, Yvonne. And it's literally a whole cake from Elan. How amazing is that? I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. Me and the family are going to gobble this up. I'm going to invite the girls around. Let's have some cake. So, there's another bag um, with some goodies. So, I have some new pyjamas, girls, from Bow Avenue. How thoughtful. I have some new pyjamas. Let me place that here. Um, I have, okay, I have a Charlotte Tilbury. Oh, my God. I have a Charlotte Tilbury Hydrated Glowing Skin. So four steps to glowing skin. So this is skincare. Let me see if I can like open it so we can see what's in there. I'll try to pull up. 
Oh no, it's sellotaped. Okay, but I'm 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 assuming it's just their skincare. So does it say what's on the back? Okay, we've got the glow toner, um, serum, magic cream as well. So woo! My friend was actually asking me if I have magic cream. She's want to spend fifty pound on magic cream, so she'll be so grateful to hear that I have magic cream now. So I'm seeing her today actually. So she's lucky. Okay, from Elan we have a drinks tumbler. We have, oh my gosh, advent calendars. I'm going to get like three, four pieces of chocolate in this morning because I think today's the third or the fourth. So I'm behind. Yay me. Also have, um, oh my God, a Christmas tree mug. Cute. It's from Elan. There's a lot of merch in here. A Santa mug, phenomenal. You know, I love a hot chocolate. <laughs> um, oh my god, some melting chocolate spoons. Oh no, guys, my hot chocolate is about to be on a new level. Are you joking? What some melting chocolate spoons? That is insane. Like, come on, don't play with it. We also have um. Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk on the go kit. So this is like a lip kit. So cute. I think I'll also put this in the bag because I have way too many lip products as is. Oh my god, and a candle. An Elan candle. How cute. So nice. And lastly, we have some Christmas tree decorations. So some ornaments for the tree. And a mask which i think i'll put in the bag also because i have so many eye masks and sleeping masks but i should probably um let me take some stories of oh, these lips <laughs> let me take some stories and i'll talk you guys through what i'll be doing today oh no my phone's ringing oh. They're really bad stuff. They look like black disease. All right. There's something in history, black death or something. That's what it's giving. I'm going to shower. And what have you done to them? I haven't done anything. They look so bad. Look, guys. But I also haven't put any moisturiser on. No. See, my lips are not moisturised. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie said no. <laughs> <laughs> that is so bad I know it imagine how I feel it feels it feels so uncomfortable and I try not to like stretch my lips because like seriously like look at that this is the most off band thing I've ever seen in my life do you know what I mean I'm showing it's the girls webs. and they've gotten so dark they're actually black you've got black lips yeah, but I know it's not going to last long. And you only go like that. And when you talk, you can see the bed. Yeah, but it's going to go. It's going to go. I can see it was all black this morning, like in the vlog this morning. It was like black all here and here. This pink wasn't there. So my pink is coming back. I think the skin is shedding away now. I don't know I what's like happening. Your nails. Oh, thank you. I just got my usual what I'd normally get. I didn't even show you guys my nails that I got recently. They're not usual, they've got glitter on them. No, these are the ones that I normally get, but I didn't do, I did a clear base instead of a, you know, oh my, guys, I have to go! Okay, I'm fresh out of the shower, and this is what it looks like right now. They're actually a bit sore. They're quite sore. I don't know what I've done. I haven't offended anyone, God, have I? Like, is this karmic? Like, <laughs> Is this karma? I'm just unpackaging my Koba lip balm that I just um, unboxed for you guys this morning. And she is going right on the lip. I'm sorry. I'm going to leave the lip oils for now. So I think I just need something balmy and thick right now. Um, oh, they actually, they actually are. They actually are sore. They are quite... The centre is really quite sore. I've even... Bro, I haven't even kissing anyone. <laughs> Bro, what the hell? 
tunnel vision, celibacy, you know? I haven't done a thing. So what the hell is, it has to be the weather. No, it's definitely, I'm not excited. No, no, no. This has got to be the weather. I'm not that upset by this. It is quite shocking. I'm going to document my journey with these lips, my lip transformation, because these lips, they have to transform. God, they have to transform. They can't stay like this. Uh, 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 God forbid. Under, over my, over my living body. No way. What? These lips have to change. What God cannot do does not exist. These lips are going to change. I mean, I don't even... S okay. <laughs> this is my Ren um, toner. It's almost done. That's what I just like to use in the day. Today I'm going out with Friendly Shade, a few of the girls from Friendly Shade. Um, you know, my childhood friends, the girls I grew up with, because it was actually Yolanda's birthday last month, but I was unable to attend because I was just all over the place. I was very, very busy. So I said, you know what, when December comes, let's make some time in all of our diaries and I will personally take you out any dinner you want to go on just pick your restaurant so yeah i'm just gonna get ready today and go to dinner for eight we're going to i believe we're going to it it's restaurant she picked it so i've never been there um stephanie's not coming because she's in birmingham so i think it's just gonna be me precious yolanda and alexa i think i have to confirm if she's coming today but yeah a vitamin C this is from rock I was using their um, vitamin C tablets beforehand but those are finished now and I had some of the liquid serum so I've just traded it out swapped it out um, I don't know what serum I'll use after but vitamin C is so important to me my topicals I don't know if they sell this in the UK yet this was actually sent to me in PR. Um, I believe I got a question about that. I just saw it actually today when I was going through all my YouTube details. And yeah, guys, this was sent to me. So I don't know if it's available in the UK yet. If it is, it will be linked in the description box along with everything else, always. Kiehl's eye cream. I literally can't even see that. Anyone chilling at home in the UK that isn't wrapped up like this, I just look at them like, you guys got money. Like, do you know what it is to be chilling in your home this time of the year, with this current, these current energy prices, and you're just wearing shorts, shorts, and a crop top. Excuse me, absolutely not, no way. Or you must have some amazing insulation. Like, I'm talking triple quadruple glazed windows because it's just not possible i'm sorry i need to wrap up even as i'm sitting here all that's going through my mind is i need to quickly wear something warm so i don't lose the warmth that i've gained in the shower where is my spf la, 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 bondi sands spf this is the right amount guys each finger. This is the same amount of SPF I use every day, and it's going to put on my face and my neck. Skincare done. Um, I'm trying to book in a repair because I have a crack on my windscreen. Okay, can I just have your name, please? Yvonne. Thank you, Yvonne. So, unfortunately, the bookings team are closed on Sundays and they're open tomorrow morning from 8 o'clock. Oh, I see. Could I, would I be able to at least get a quote or do I have to wait till tomorrow for that also? Yeah, it would be tomorrow because we're not trained um, in anything to do with repairs and such. So, it would be the service team or the bookings team that you would need to speak with. Okay, all right then. All right. Okay, all right, thank you. I 
really want to use um, these baby hairs. I don't really do baby hairs, if I'm being completely honest with you. But, you know me, I'm more of a no baby hair type of girly. I'm going to grab the um, face and base niacinamide sodium hyaluronate. I hope I pronounced that. I hope I pronounced that correctly. I'm just going to use this to prime. I'm absolutely not giving a makeup tutorial because I just don't have the capacity. <laughs> My lips are black. I don't have the capacity. That feels so good to the point where I even want to apply a bit more. It's instantly like mattifying, but I don't feel dry. Oh my gosh, I even have my blurring powder. I should definitely try that today. See how I get on with that. But I'm going to do my makeup and I will come back. Or should you guys get ready? No, I'm just like, I just don't, I honestly don't have the capacity, guys. Yeah. And I want to play some music. I guess I could play. Yeah, no, sorry guys. Next time, I promise. Guys, Precious is here late as usual. Time to go at half six and it is. Hey Google, what's the time? Seven o'clock. No, I've been here. She's been here for like five minutes, please. Yeah, 20. You, you, no, 20 minutes. <laughs> See lies. Maybe 10. But guys, this is my outfit. I'm just wearing like a t shirt and leather um, a leather slit skirt. And again, the Prada heels because I'm obsessed. Um, Where's the coat from? The coat is from Michael Kors, but it was like last season. I mean, not last, well, yeah, last season, this is from last year, their Love fall it. winter collection, but, and I'm just carrying this bag oh, again because that was the bag that was out, and <laughs> I can't think of anything else. Oh, birthday girl. You like to wear your shoes? That's so uncomfortable. <sighs> These are so uncomfortable. Who's driving? I'll drive. Oh, yay. I'll drive. Mm -hmm. That makes me happy. Oh, I you guys are going to see the crack on my screen. It's so bad. Did you let Rachel tell me you on the phone? Right? Yeah, I was on the phone. What did they say? They won, um, their body shop or whatever isn't open on Sunday, so I need to call on Monday, right. tomorrow. Um, yeah. I didn't know if I wanted to give hot girl vibe. I guess this is fine. When I take off, when I take off my coat, it is very, like, chill. Cool. So... Yeah. Okay, let's go and pick up this white girl. <laughs> Your favourite <laughs> white girl. <laughs> Look at our white girl. Yes, baby. Oh my God, the top is sad. Sad boys, it's in a good location, but where are you going to park? Don't no worry, I'll find somewhere. Oh, so crispy I know, I love it. Hey, Sam, what are you doing? Oh, you're so cute. Oh, thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Um, no, thank you. Right, this is getting a bit messy. Is it recording? Make a wish, yeah, babe. Make a wish, make a wish. Sunday night. Wait. Just make sure my eyes, there's no sleep in my eyes because I'm just waking up. Um, let me close my door. Guys, look at my lips. I think they're improving. I, I applied some lip balm. Um, they're not a sort this morning and my shade is coming back. Thank God. So hopefully by the end of this vlog, I'll be back to being YV because this is giving 
my this isn't even giving my Nigerian government name this is just giving who is she so yeah like it's there's there's some progress there but guys last week I only went to the gym once I was only able to go to the gym once and I had such a good session but I just it's Monday morning and ideally I should be in the gym right now or I should have come back from the gym and I wasn't even able to fully attend prayer this morning because I was so tired I was in and out of sleep throughout the whole prayer session which is not ideal this like my consistency is going a bit like this because each day is a new day and I'm sleeping at different times every day which is not ideal but yesterday was so nice I'm, yeah it was like a happy belated to Yolanda so Yolanda if you're watching this happy belated to you again I'll take you out for dinner every every day of the year for the rest of my life if I could and if there wasn't a recession <laughs> the wig is going strong however I'm so glad not it being stuck to my okay wait okay yeah wig's going strong feels good to wake up with um your hair done i should be doing this more often in all honesty yeah this feels this feels right my lips are coming back my hair's done i woke up like this I'm so sorry guys I have not been as active look at the lips they're improving they're still dry AF though Stephanie's back um we I haven't been as active on this vlog this week because I haven't been that active on this vlog this week because we're in the process of moving like there's a lot going on there's a lot going on um we're trying to pack everything up oh do you know what when you grow up in a house and you live there like your whole My lips are so dry, life. I can't do this. Hold it, I need to fix myself. When you grow up somewhere and you live there practically your whole life, you don't realise how much stuff you have until it's time to like take it all out. So we are just, you know, as you do, it's going to be a long night. There's no one sleeping today. Yeah, because we've been procrastinating. <laughs> we've left it so last minute. Um, yeah, but first pizza, guys. I ordered pizza because we actually need to sit down and eat. We need to eat. Um, I just wanted to catch you guys up. I'll probably be like vlogging at intervals, but I just have to have my head in the game. I just remembered I haven't been vlogging, so I thought I might as well come and show myself. The wigs are going strong though. It could no, be worse. it looks so good. <laughs> my lips are so. Mine are dry. I need to get a lip balm. Yeah, but I literally just applied lip balm and they still look dry. They're still peeling. This pizza is so perfect. Oh, he's. I don't know what our local is doing, but they're just getting it right. Like, look at that crust. Look at the colour. Wait, it's not stuffed. No, it's not stuffed. Absolutely not. Never stuffed. This is just um, you know, classic. It looks like stuffed. Like, yeah okay let's have some now before it gets cold <laughs> no like we've literally been up all night well i did have about I four hours sleep. of sleep i had about I four hours of sleep for an hour and that was all and sorry I've been guys we have Look made so <laughs> this is how you made me trish journey <laughs> We have made so much progress, but the only thing is, we don't actually know where all this stuff is going because the house we're moving into isn't even ready yet. It's not ready yet, so um, we can't even just put all these things straight into the new home. Um, also, we need to downsize. I'm very much on downsize. We have so much stuff, guys. Like, look. This is just this is room. just my room. Not including shoes. I still haven't. I still need to like remove oh, my light clothes. fixtures. Oh, and I still haven't. I haven't done my clothes. Um, but this isn't going to take me too long. And this is just like the first wardrobe of clothes. There's a second wardrobe. These is like this is the neutral clothing. 
upstairs we have all the coloured clothes. All the party clothes. Well, the party clothes are the glitz and the glam. Um, yeah, let me show you guys. We have so much going on. My mum has slowed down this process times a thousand. Um, yeah. Someone actually commented in one of my last vlogs, oh, congratulations on the new flat or home that the candle thing that like I said gave it away oh, yeah. and I must have been like oh thank you in Jesus name <laughs> <Because> <laughs> but yeah no I'm I'm not moving out yet I don't even know when I'll move out to be honest I have no desire to move out if I'm being completely honest with you like I just love being with my family and it just makes my life so much easier if I'm being completely honest yeah, with you yeah she doesn't she doesn't eat yeah she they're very herself all day. yeah because if it's if I just live by myself I would literally not eat um no i think i would when i was in you when i was living by myself i would do all my busy. meal prep on then, yeah no i wasn't as busy now. it's true so we need to order breakfast yeah <laughs> no we just we weren't taking it seriously at all um we underestimate how many how much no have. i didn't underestimate how much stuff is in this house this is 10 we've been in this house for like 10 years this is 10 years worth of stuff and don't even get me started on the garage. I feel like African parents. Let's talk about it. This is the if I the only if the only reason I would ever want to move out was to get away from my mum's hoarding. That's the only thing. You know, Everything else, house, like I live a fantabulous life at home. It's literally like having my own studio at home. My lips are still so dry, and well, they're actually improving. They used to be really, 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 really black. Um, a few days ago, as you guys saw, they were really bad. But, but just imagine. I feel like the reason why African parents hoard, though, is because it's like no, but what, they, background where they're coming from. Think about it. Like just yeah, to, they keep everything. They keep background. everything because everything it's like they don't. Like can be used for something yeah, like that. used for something. They don't want to be in a position where oh, they used to have that and now they don't. I think that is. And I think it needs to be studied, like, why African parents yeah, hoard so much. Vibe. And we've been trying, like, bless my mum. She's really tried, though. Like, with our help, we've really pushed her to, like, get rid of so many things in the last year, two years. But even that, it's still so much. Like, if I show, like, guys, half of this is plates. These boxes are just filled with plates. But, but mum has a good yeah mum does have a really good collection of plates like she likes to really she's a real like lady of leisure she's isn't she real, like she's a real no, what's that martha stewart like play yeah, yeah she is very she's much that mom. kind of girl so like makes her to like that but um yeah david's just gone out with mum gone to like drop lots of stuff at the charity shop just to give away some things because there's so many things that we don't need to take with us. Um, yeah. Yeah. This is actually crazy. You haven't started the garage. I'm not starting. It's not me and you. Me, I'm not involved. I, all I'll do in that garage is take my bag of coats. All I'm going to take from that garage. That's actually all I have in that garage. Is that my key? And my lighting my equipment. Really cute bedding. Your bedding. Yeah, because that's like the theme of my new room. Fair. And that's another thing. Like, I don't know. Am I going to redecorate? I don't know if I can be bothered to, um, like, am I taking this bed with me? It's just so... My bed, that is, bed is so big. It's so big. It's so heavy. It's, it's so thing. hard to... Full of gifts. When I was even putting it together, it took a that whole... Is. It took a whole day to assemble. Not sort of dissembling it now. Like, I just we can't even bear to think of it. We had to reassemble. We did some things wrong. Yeah, it's like I don't even know if I still have the instructions. I realized how we've been viewing houses sort of this whole process. I didn't realize how big our rooms were until I would enter some homes and be like, "What the fuck? Like, how do people? There's no wardrobe space. I don't know how people do it." And it just goes to show that, look, if someone can live like live like that with just like a bed. No, and not that's why clothes. I think we're doing too much and we need to downsize. Yeah. Like, I'm not no, trying to be funny, to be and it, it just ends up being a headache. Yeah. I'm really it's not so like, guys, I, we have about the, 10 mirrors in this house, bro. Why do we have that much stuff? Like, we need to, mirrors, like, I, mean, I want we need to downsize ones. on a crazy level. Like, I just want to have things that, oh, even mirror. when it comes to my clothing, I just want to have things that I'm you wearing wear. all yeah, the I've time and I'm rotating. I've done that, 
I haven't done that. I mean, I I thought I had done that, yeah, and then haven't. I haven't actually. Haven't. Yeah, no, I still need to do that. So, guys, this is gonna be what? What is this vlog even gonna be called? It's a bit chaotic. Sorting out my life. Sorting, yeah, sorting <laughs> out my life. Downsizing. Um, moving. <laughs> moving. Um, I mean, we well, started off. Really, I think preparing for the new year. Yeah. Yeah. New, yeah, new, new year. beginnings for the new year. One hundred percent. This fucking TV. Oh, we haven't even thought about the TV. And where are these? Are we taking these sofas? I'm sorry. And these curtains. I hate guys. I hate. I hate every curtain in this household. My curtains. <laughs> these. Fun. My mum loves her balance cow. <laughs> But you know what I really am looking forward to doing is just giving everything a whole new vibe. Yes, oh my god, yes. Everything a whole like new a vibe. Chic vibe like I think chic, I'm gonna change my theme in my room as well. Yeah. I think I want it to be darker. Yes, but then yeah. again it's kind of no, like no, no. filming I wise. Think you're not gonna film in your room, you just said that. Oh my god, it's true. But what if I do I want, want to sometimes? Bags. That's what I was thinking. That, that full pop from the that's um, what I was thinking. That's why I just don't want to. I realised why I really liked it. When I went to Athens, the bed in that hotel was like that as well. And it was stunning. And that's on my mood board for my new bedroom. Just like black neutrals with like just little pops of colours with like books or like a yeah. chair. Nothing. Not no, I, I'm going to get rid of so much stuff because I don't even want to have so much stuff anymore. But it just, your chair's going to look so good like in with that theme. But I don't even think, where I'm even thinking, I don't even think my room, my, where my future room, I don't think it's going to be big enough to even put that chair in. That will probably be in the dressing room or yeah. filming room. I don't really know. We're going to all figure it out together. Um, bro. Guys, shock of life. Guess what I'm eating? <laughs> bon appetit. This is as good as it gets right now. Breakfast is served. Hey, so you spoken with your sister? Stephanie, cheers. No, no, why? Have wrong? you finished that already? Know, she just called me. Oh. She was really freaked out. Let's go to vibe. We're not home. A whole lot of stuff. Just saying, even though all of it. <laughs> um, do you know, off-flavor this is gonna be scary. Yeah. What is? Oh, the video. Oh, that's amazing, guys. We are on our way to storage. Um, Stephanie is with my mum. We've got David with me. So we're gonna put these things into storage. Um, and they'll probably be there until our house, our new house, is ready. And we're gonna go to my cousins this evening. And just spend the weekend with them. That's the plan, really. It's been a hectic 24 hours. Like, as you can see, I look... Bro, we've shatried. Like, we have done a mad thing. We really have, so... <sighs> yeah, man, I just don't know how... I don't really have much to say. I'm drained. I'm absolutely drained. Hey guys, coming to you live, <laughs> Stephanie, <laughs> from our storage space. Like, look at all this stuff. Stephanie's with me. We've come quickly to pick up some. Well, I'm not picking. Are you picking up multiple outfits? I'm not. I just I'm can't stress myself. I'm just gonna. I'm here trying to find like an outfit, so I have to go through. Some of I these bags. I think we're the first thing you see, bro. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Oh, Phenom. My toes aren't done. Do You're going to get your toes done tomorrow. I need to get mine done, to be honest. Because mine are all chipping. Yeah, basically, I have a Linda Farrow dinner tomorrow. I was on the fence about whether I should go or not, but I've been persuaded to go, you know, and I I'm here. Life? This is a bit longer though. Stephanie, it's cold. What? This is great. What else are you going to wear? Open. Yeah, so you have a coat, right? You can even wear this, like, just... I think it's fine. But now I know that... This that would be nice if you do that and then you put that on the shoulders. That on your shoulders. Are you sick? It doesn't matter. It's winter. The coat doesn't... No, no, no. You're going to annoy me now. I'm leaving. Oh, no, I haven't even found my outfit. <laughs> what is this? This is cute. Let me have this. No. <laughs> Dumb, dumbass hoe. 
<laughs> okay, let me actually find something because this is absolutely ridiculous. I don't know what kind of vlog this is going to be, guys. Because <laughs> scattered vlog. <laughs> This is not giving lady of leisure. It's, it's not giving soft life. Um, okay. How do you do this again? One more. This one like this. Isn't it? Don't piss me off there. Okay. The thing is, I have, I just want to open this bag and the first thing that I see that's appropriate, I'm just going to make work. I'm not going through these multiple bags. I'm sorry. I just cannot. I don't have the capacity. What black heels would I even wear though? Do you have heels that are just in a dust bag? Do you want to wear my black Alexander Wangs? They're in a dust bag. What size are they? Five? Yeah. Yeah, I'll wear them. They're com they look so comfortable right now, aren't they? Yeah. If we took a holiday, dun 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 dun, took some time to celebrate. Where's my jewelry box? That's the other now. Okay, I'm done then. Wait, where's my bag of bags? Oh, YV bags. Where's YV bags? <laughs> oh. No, my YV bags are here. I'll just pick something No, up. I hope you didn't put my bag of bags, my travel I don't know where bag. that is. Don't ask. The basket bag is there. No, my orange and green one. I don't even think that's here. Sweet. Yes, it is here. Well, it's not here. You squashed it. If you squash my... No, don't be stupid. Slabs. Stephanie, what do you want me to do now? Uh, what did you put are you in? joking? No, I don't know. I don't even remember seeing it. If I'm being completely honest with you. Be careful. Yvonne, that's not funny. Like, this is actually... This is not funny. We come here for outfits. That's what we're doing. Everything else we'll have to deal with later. No, my bags I'm are so sorry. <laughs> Stop. I'm not leaving. <laughs> Stephanie, stop! Oh, let's get out of this place now! <laughs> you fucking... You fucking... Not out of react now! No, okay, now you're pissing me off. No, all of that. No, we're not doing this! Uh, you're annoying me! No, it's clearly up. not here. Okay, I think it's here. Okay, amazing, we've seen it. It's not getting squashed. No, wait, wait. I don't think it is. Don't Stephanie, think put is. everything back! Stephanie, I'm stop! I need to get my ear into my jewel box, which is right here. You're, this girl is getting ear... No! Auntie Inca has earrings. <laughs> 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 now nah, you're taking it's the. just right there. Literally in that blue bag. Just... No, Stephanie. Stop uh... calling my name. Look at your pile. Focus on yourself. <laughs> right, yeah, mum. If you go here, this is my pile. This is a shit. This is just this is fucking shit. <laughs> There's no organisation. No, there is organisation. This okay. is your pile. It's not my fault or your shit. Listen, just because you don't have a business that you're passionate about, and I know how to run a fucking business. <laughs> okay, get me some earrings too then, some See nice black mouth. ones. I'm definitely going to wear this um, Izumiyaki this dress. This is the thing though, are my black ones in... Guys, this is what I'm going to wear. I think it's appropriate, even though it's bright yellow. But to be honest, why would I, why would I stop wearing colour? What? Because it's Christmas. Oh, but I don't want to waste this outfit. I imagined myself Gorgeous. on holiday with this. No, I'm looking for more stuff. I'm so sorry. I can't go out like this. I just can't. Nope. Maybe I should do a stud, though. I had, I had my heart set on that for holiday. Why would I now do something stupid? Hey guys, so life update. I've got my cousin Michael in the back because he's taking full advantage of this situation and he wants me to drop him at the station. So life update. I'm currently staying with my cousins until our new home is ready. Today, me and Steph have an event. I have a dinner, um, but the, um, her, Bella and Tamara will kind of like meet me at the after party after. So I have a dinner tonight with Linda Farrow. So yesterday what you saw was like us trying to like look for an outfit. An outfit. Well, an outfit we don't even know. <laughs> what's going on so i'm on my way to bella's right now and i will i'll probably stay at bella's overnight tonight hopefully the house will be ready by when when's what's today was today tuesday hopefully by friday latest friday latest yeah friday latest because there's still a lot of unpacking and moving in that ne moving in that needs to be done so ideally so yeah that is this has probably been like a very chaotic vlog um 
but yeah you guys did get it right in my last my well two vlogs ago i am moving and i have we have found like a new family home so hopefully everything will be ready this week and we can start you know decorating and i can take you guys on that journey with me as well so you know we still gotta make shit work we still gotta turn up we still gotta go outside you know so that's what we're doing today even though i really didn't want to go but bills still gotta get well not bills because this is actually not getting paid but <laughs> still have to make some appearances yeah. <laughs> keep up yeah keeping up appearances but yeah oh amazing that'll be that'll be preferred yeah I was given a quote already. I was I told around six hundred. Okay. Yes, I see you. I see you. Okay. Amazing. Yes, please. Thank you so much. Who am I speaking with? Thank you so much. Thank me. I look forward to hearing back from you. Thank you. Guys, I am finally getting my windscreen repaired like i'm so happy it's been ghetto it's been out of, or out of brand it's been off brand i'm at butters by the way oh my god this is the oh first god, time yes, guys i'm seeing it in person what the what, hell no, you i don't want to touch you. it <laughs> it's above my pay grade yeah put some respect for my name Yeah, it was a, it, a good month. No, trust me with all your secrets, guys. I don't. I don't tell. I, 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 I'm just so happy she had no clue, like none. Aww. Big YV, you know. Hi, me. I'm gonna start a business. If you guys, if like all the men watching this, if you wanna propose to your babe and you want someone to like, you know, organize it, get everything done without having a clue, I'm your girl. But I have no idea. None. And she's like, oh, shut the hair, shut the hair, wait. <laughs> girl. It wasn't that hair. The thing is, it never tells me to change my hair, you know. She never, so I was just like, oh my gosh. Yeah, she probably thought it was bad. Yeah. I, was like, oh. I was like, oh no, maybe it's bad. And then I said, to Ali, I was just like, no, it wasn't like that. And the thing is, me and Ali had spoken <laughs> exactly. before. And it was just like, because oh, when she was on the phone to me, <laughs> when she was on the phone to me, she was like, oh yeah, even Ade did a thing. So I was like, not Ade. <laughs> in the room with him yeah, yeah, so yeah. when she walks in she can get her real reaction she was like what in the room with me i was like yeah trust me she's gonna think it's gay images <laughs> and she literally <laughs> thought she was I like oh flash in my eyes so i couldn't even see what <laughs> was going on i thought i was security <laughs> no, genuinely, i was thinking the man in black i was like photographers get images and then i was like oh wait 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 uh, <laughs> you have i was that shocked i was crazy i was shocked I couldn't believe it. Imagine like, if you had that picture of your low cut, your I'm level two fade. I was devastated. Devastated. Like devastated. No, no, no. <laughs> devastated. Hey, I said to Ade, there's under no circumstances yeah, can you yeah. both have a level two fade no, 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 we couldn't. in your we engagement couldn't. photos. No, no Experimental way. Experimental As beautiful as it was, yeah, yeah, it was yeah. gorgeous and she looks yeah. phenomenal, no, but not for... Yeah, and I was even saying this hair would have been good. I even said this hair. And she was like, nah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Wow. The oh, blonde was really nice though against everything. Oh my god, Bella! Oh, sorry, sorry. That's no, Bella's sorry. fault. No, it's not, it's fine. Here we are unwrapping. Oh guys, this is Bella's assistant. No, hello. No, obviously I'm good. To be honest, we have nice got some gem in the juice. Oh. What did you guys have? Where did you guys go? We went to Straits Kitchen. Remember Pan Pacific? That oh yeah, yes. Yeah. Oh, Wait, what is this? They have a what's it called? Oh, brunch, don't they? No. Stephanie, did you order have... this? What is this? It's a pan of Are you joking? Yeah. Oh, you yeah, didn't ask me if I wanted one. Oh, that's, that's 
smell it's nice. really good. It smells great. It's so good. Mm. Let's just be real. Okay, me and Steph, we are off to get our nails and toes done. We're not nails. I'm trying to tell no, her not I'm... to do her nails because it's Guys, not. The... We don't have the time for it though. You don't have the time for it. Well, that's okay, if that's what you want to do. But I'm just gonna get my feet done because it's really, really bad. I need to wear sandals. So it's so cold. I feel like I'm crying. Do you know what, guys? It could be worse. Like, I'm still giving them fashion. It's still giving a bit on brand, you know? Yeah, it is so cold. I actually feel like I'm crying. And do you know what? This battery has really lasted me because I haven't charged this camera in Since. days. No, I haven't. Wow. I think the last time I charged it was on uh, probably Thursday, maybe Friday. Okay. Ooh, okay. So no matter how uncomfortable and inconvenient things get, me and Stephanie are always going to find a way to enjoy ourselves. <laughs> She's getting her feet done too. I was only supposed to come in for a, a nail paint change because all my paint was chipping. Are you really? I'm not going to get I haven't even picked my colour yet. I'm just going to do red on my toes because my dress tonight is red. I tried it on at Bella's and it's, it's fine. It's cute. Maybe I should have made it with that. That's actually nice as well. I might just change my colour. I need to learn to charge this camera when we get back in. <sighs> I can't wait to wear makeup. I haven't worn makeup in so long. I haven't glowed up in so long. How long have it been, actually? I say so long. It's just, I went out with Precious and Amanda on Sunday. <laughs> this is how you know I'm not used to this man. Oh, yeah, it was Sunday. Yeah. Was Sunday. Yeah, it was after Sunday. It feels so long ago. That's how much we've done this week. That's how hectic this week has been for us to be crazy. This is so cold. It's a bit, it's a bit too cold to be getting pedicures in the winter. I'm actually freezing. Oh, this is the fit guys. I don't know. It's looking a bit big. Are you guys really sure that this isn't look too big? It looks good. Are you sure? Yeah, it does really look good. I think it looks really nice with one. I thought this was how to see you. you know, but it's, you said it wasn't. Very festive. All this red that I'm wearing these days. Yeah, I guess it's because I've lost weight then. I'm a bit kind of, um, all right, let me go. You guys, don't be late. Ah, oh, who knows? You got this shit. and I've decided to drive I'm by myself and it feels a bit weird because I feel like I haven't had any time to myself for the past like at least five days um, and I'm normally by myself a lot actually so it is nice but it feels weird like it feels like oh my god there's no noise around me it's just me this is the outfit I'm wearing I don't love her like I love this dress and I love this I love this baby dress I love the outfit but I don't think now was the time for me to wear it, although it's like Christmas and everything and it suits the vibe and it's just really nice and easy to put on. Um, I mean, you guys saw the stress and the wahala of that storage unit, so there was literally no searching for anything, it just wasn't going to happen. I just would have preferred to have worn this, you know, when I've like, like figured out the accessories and figured out... And when my weight would have been a bit different because all that gym that I've been doing guys when I tell you I lose weight like crazy because I haven't really been eating well as well because I've just been on the go all the time like just moving is just such a hassle so I've probably been averaging one meal a day at best and yeah your girl is skin tinting but yeah we'll see we'll see I hope this is a good dinner um yeah i do think it'll be good i think it'll be fun but it's just getting there now 
I'm like 28 minutes away. It starts at 7.30. Um, it's 7.34 right now, but I didn't want to arrive dead on 7.30 if I'm being completely honest with you. So trust me, I this is still the new leaf. I have very much still changed. I just didn't want to be just there waiting for everyone to arrive. I prefer to just arrive and see everyone there already. So it's looking like that's what it's going to be. I know we're going to be seated from 7.45 as well. So that's nice. I know probably by then like everyone will be seated and I'll just walk in I don't really know who's going I know of one person Louise and she's like the creative director and stylist for Vogue and they did tell me she was gonna be there and asked if I wanted to be seated next to her because she's a fellow black girl so I said of course 100% um, but yeah I mean it could be worse at the end of the day like I'm still so grateful about so much that's going on in my life um, this is just a, a minor bump in the road. Well, it's not even really a bump because we've known we're going to be moving for months. It's just the lack of planning behind it that's really affecting me. And I think even if there was planning behind it, it still would have really affected me because the amount of stuff we have as a family is just insane. So I just can't wait for the new chapter and to just really, you know, settle down and take you guys on that journey with me because I think it's going to be really interesting. So I think we're going to do some really nice, interesting stuff stuff it's interesting stuff with the home in terms of decor because we did leave a lot of our old furniture because we all agree that we kind of want new things so that's going to be nice Ooh, what is going on there's a lot of there's a lot of commotion fire brigade no matter how much i drive i will never get used to like sirens, I always feel like, oh my god, they want me to move, where do I move without causing a hazard, without hurting someone or bashing someone's car, it's always very much like, <gasps> ah, anxiety, but I'm a pro, like, I'm a Von Hamilton behind the wheel, don't play, but yeah guys, I'm gonna jump off and I will see you guys at the event, yeah, I really hope this isn't a vegan dinner, because I, I need some meat, I need some meat, I need some bread, I need to fill up. My belly needs to be full. Me want belly full. <laughs> but yeah, let's just go. Oh, thank you. Yes, I am. So it's not here. You've been? No, no, yeah. Well, I think it's not here. Hopefully not. Yeah. It's crazy because it's the first time. Oh, are you not going? No, I already Oh, you already gone? And then I'm going to do this and then I'm going to go back. Oh, okay. How was it? Oh, you're passionate. I love those drawings. Good. to wait for them because I was we, your girl was cold. We ordered Chinese as well. Yeah, can you imagine? We ordered Chinese, I had to leave. And did it? Really? We rushed to get here only for you to come downstairs and be like, I'm coming home. No, you're not. Stay there. Stephanie, you look like me. I'm looking at you like, wow, you're oh, actually sick today. That's a compliment. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, it looks good. I'm still in that wrap. To you can speak to the good morning guys yesterday was so cold and I've come to the conclusion that I will no longer be leaving my house for any type of soft life because this weather just isn't soft nothing about this weather is soft it's giving struggle it's hard it's cold my heart goes out to those that are actually homeless like in this weather because I cannot even stand outside for five minutes. It is freezing. It's not even January. It's not even February and it is this cold. When was the last time we had snow before Christmas? It is freezing. I'm so cold. It's, well, I'm not so cold right now, but last night it was so cold. Like, the last clip we guys saw was in the car because I went out for five minutes and I just couldn't go back inside because I walked Louise out because she was leaving and I was obviously waiting for Stephanie and Bella and in that little time I spent outside I had to go sit in my car and blast the heating it is that cold um and you know what's crazy about everything it's like the current situation in this country this country is failing so many people 
like it's cold. We know it's cold every year, it gets cold. But I'm always shocked by the extent of the cold. And this year has taken it to new heights. This year is a new level of cold. I don't even want to go anywhere. I don't even want to do anything. I don't, I don't even think I'm going to, I'm even also so tired. It's a point where I just don't even feel like I'm going to be travelling this December, if I'm being honest. Normally, like, I travel very last minute. But I don't think I'm going to, with all the moving stuff as well. It's just not looking realistic. And your guy has to save some money, because what the fuck? Like, we don't even know what 2023 holds in store for us, because January, February, March, everyone brace yourselves. Save your coin, cash is king, hold your peas, babes. I don't know if I'll come back to Bella's or if I'll go back to my auntie's, but my auntie's household is a boy's household. It's a boy house. She's a boy mum. Like, four boys in the house. Like, a, a household full of boys is a very, very different household. Oh, my God. These boys are disgusting. Boys are disgusting. Sorry, boys are disgusting. Um, I'm so glad I only have one. <laughs> I'm so glad I only have one, so I'm still deciding what I'll do. Um, but the priority right now is to just get this windshield fixed because it's getting colder and colder and I don't want to... Um, it's, it's, it's dangerous. It's a risk and it's a hazard. So luckily, I can get that sorted today. So I'll go all the way to Bedford um, today because they're the ones that have it. And I kind of want to always go to the Bedford Mercedes-Benz because... I know them there and customer service is great. I've built a relationship with them and I'm just loyal. If I get an experience, I don't, it's like, wherever I move, I'm always going to go to that Mercedes Benz. Always, always, always because I just love them there. So that is the plan today. That's what we're going to do. Yesterday was nice. The dinner was cute. It was really, really lovely. I finally met Louise. We've been following each other for years and we've just never met. So that was nice. We bonded. We're both Tauruses. We're both Nigerians. So it was just such a blast. We had so much fun. The after party, mm, not so much. But guys, the sunglasses I got gifted. I'm going to, I don't think, I think I left them in the car. So I'm going to have to show you guys probably later. I'll show you guys the sunglasses later. This is like, remember at the beginning of the vlog, when I was like unboxing um, what Elan Cafe sent to me, this cute pajama set was in it, and this is what I've been wearing. Um, because when I was like packing my bag of like essentials, I'd already packed up all my PJs and everything. But luckily, I saw that I'd still left out like the Elan gift bag, and I just took it. And it's so cute. The color is phenomenal. It's really, really, really nice. But um, yeah, man. I just really hope I don't come down with a cold as well. This will, That would be the worst thing to happen right now with everything that's going on. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, Bella's still asleep. Stephanie's in the shower. I'm about to jump in the shower and just get the day started. Um, yeah. Also, guys, my lips are back. <laughs> Some positivity. Nice. Not mad at it. Mm. It's giving future. I love it. Guys, I'm at Mercedes now. <laughs> Cornell's helping oh, wow. me. Our favourite Cornell. Look, it's massive, isn't it? I haven't even shown my vlog. Like, it's you so bad. Vlog, yeah, I'm going to put it on my vlog. Look how... Oh, sorry. Like, guys, look. I don't know if you can see, but it starts all the way down here and it goes to the top there. It's so bad. It's almost oh, edge to edge. Huh? Yeah, you can see where it started. Like, it literally started... Yeah, it started here, and then it, like, extended to the bottom, and then to the top. Yeah, you're lucky it didn't smash, like, while you were driving. And I've done a lot of, like, long-distance driving. Here you go. Thank you. Do you want to say hello to them? Our favourite. Hello. <laughs> so what are we going to do? Well, we're going to show you a car first. Absolutely not. <laughs> Let me give this to Mike, all right? I'll meet okay. you inside. Okay, thank you. Let's look at what they have. Is that C? <gasps> Guys, look at this red CLA. It's gorgeous. It's my car, but red. It's stunning. Red is actually quite nice, you know. But I don't think it has a... Does it have a sunroof? Oh, this is gorgeous. So what was all that talk about? Oh, we don't know if we'll be getting another one in. I could have saved my money. I wouldn't be driving a red car personally. Gorgeous. 
I love this AMG. Oh my god. One day. Yeah, I think this is the most tired I've ever been. Ever. Well, um, what do you want to do? Because obviously you've got like three, four hours to kill. Did you want me to drop you off somewhere? Like into town or whatever? Or and walk around? <laughs> well, I don't know. You might want to go for some lunch or something. For three I hours. guess for us. Because I've got an appointment up in like half an hour. I think we should probably go somewhere. Where should we go? But the thing is, if you, if you like, you know, if I, if I drop you off somewhere in like three or four hours and you've been collecting from town, I'll just get either a lead of me or go pick you up. Okay. That way you can, I don't know, go get what a coffee somewhere, go out. Yeah, what can, what's there to do here? Do in here? town? Yeah. Uh, is there Nando's? Thank, thank you so there much. There is Nando's, yeah. There is Nando's no, in I town. think I will have Nando's. There are better places than Nando's. What, what else? Um, Alvaro Lounge is quite good. I like drink for coffee and stuff, but mm, we've got a coffee now. I'd say <laughs> coffee now, but it's not, you know, you're driving back, so. Um, that's that's the worst out of ever had in my life. Uh, really? It's so bitter. bitter. It is so bitter. What's happened? It's really bitter. That coffee? <laughs> oh. Beggars can't be tuners. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is that, what car is that? Is that my car, that grey one? Of the CLA, you guys do an AMG version. Of course, yeah. This wasn't told to yeah, me. Oh, that, oh, that is AMG. That's a thirty-five AMG. We also do forty-five AMG. That's yeah, exactly my car, around. isn't it? Just an AMG version. Yeah, I don't think I need it though. See that? Base. It's exactly the same, but red version, right? That's the exact same as mine. Yeah, but red. That is gorgeous. No, your one's better. That's an AMG line. This one, the red one. Yours a premium class, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, that's, that's the um, basic introduction level. It still looks gorgeous. It's just the colour, I think. The colour's stunning. Yeah, the colour's nice. High in the colour is red. gorgeous. But it's like, so you know, bright. That car is number one out of 500 names. Didn't you say this to us before? Is it still the same one? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, still there. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's bullshit. <laughs> But what is, there's cars in America, Mercedes, and they have like big screens. Hyper screens. Yeah. So we've got, yeah, the EQS and the EQE, they call. They're but they're, they're not electric ones. ones. Yeah, electric, yeah. But the ones in America aren't electric. They literally look like coupes, like this. Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah. Unless it's a different, yeah. Different Maybe Americans are, are getting better cars yeah. than us. A lot of things are better in America. Oh, three hours later and she's perfect. I'm so happy, guys. I felt so insecure of the crack, but it's gone now. Oh, I love these guys so much.